Hey there everyone, this is Patrick with SFMF Fishing and today I am going to be showing you a tackle box full of bait I have created for veterans. I've made seven, I actually eight, two and including the one for myself. Oh, I need to trim my beard. Um, and, um, but... I made these because I'm going to do kayak fishing instructions for vets with PTSD this summer. I'll do about three classes. So you want to see what they get to use. I picked baits that are kayak friendly and colors that are um, conducive to catching fish in the waters up here. So first... Here's the box, a Plano, one tray box, and up top here, I have in here a half ounce plug. So first I gotta teach him how to cast. Um, and that's what the plug is for. Um, if you check out my, uh, Twitter page, uh, you'll be able to see the gear I I have gotten them. But let's start from the beginning right here. They get a three eight ounce Z Man sling blades, and with this, well, actually, hold on, they get one of these in each box they get a pair of pliers to take the hook out and they get braid cutters and now with the z-man they will they will pair that up with three and a half inch pulse summer gill um, yum paddle tails. Perfect. And then each box they'll get to use an official River to Sea 90 Whopper Plopper. And that is the bone color. Bone works great around here. Then they get a crankbait. Um, it's a two to five foot diver. It is a KVD 2.5. Um, but you see the color? Pumpkin seed. Important. It's all about color. And then we have a Bandit 100. A little smaller profile. Um, something they can catch crappie on. Um, Nice, nice dark green into a chartreuse, almost like a baby poop yellow into the sparkly off-white. Very nice. Two to five foot diver also. Then they get a rebel popper. Good color to use for a popper around here is black. Then they get... A Z-Man original chatterbait, 3 8 ounce, bluegill color, with a Bass Pro Shop Tournament Series watermelon orange um, creature bait to go with this. Perfect matchup. And with the spinning gear, that was with the spinning gear um that they'll be using because they're going to learn how to use spinning gear and they're going to learn how to use a bait caster we got the yum ned dingers okay and this is a watermelon red flake and a one six ounce ned head by z-man um 
The reason why I didn't go with a Z-Man Ned rig is because I know what happens when the plastics get mixed and they I don't want to spend half my class explaining that to them. So it was easier to go with something that doesn't that isn't Elastec. And then they get a wacky rig tool extra rings and two watt wacky rig hooks v um ike hooks and they will use the five inch yum dingers watermelon and copper red nice color right there so they'll learn they'll learn how to throw all these lures, all these baits, it's a total of eight, eight different ways to fish. And um, by putting this box together for the vets, um, it cost me $127 a box to put together. Um, well worth it, more than one person will be using these. Like I said, I'll be doing three classes. Um, it's just the soft plastics are are the are the one thing that will definitely have to be replaced from time to time. So there you go. Um, all kayak friendly baits, and um, that's what I'm talking about. Easy to use from a kayak. That's what I'll be doing teaching vets this summer how to fish from a kayak and relieve their PTSD. Um, there's nothing like the going out on the water with zero anxiety around you and catching fish. Uh, nothing like it. And um, they'll get to get to learn that. And um, so if you haven't already seen my video i did a walkthrough for my um competition vid um kayak for this this coming 2022 season take a look see what i run and till next time if you know a veteran you haven't heard from him for a while please give him a buddy check make sure he's okay and until next time peace out